In this video, you'll learn how to create and use titles and text in your videos, as well as how to make your text even better by using the advanced text options in Wondershare Filmora 12. There are two ways to add text in your Filmora project. You can add text by clicking on the Quick Text tool above the project timeline, or you can click on the Titles tab at the top. After selecting a title, just drag and drop it into the project timeline. You can also increase or decrease the text duration by dragging its edges in the timeline. To change the default text and its style, click on it to open up the text editing panel. On the top, we have a text box in which you can type your text. Change the font from the drop-down below, as well as the font size. You can also change the color of your text, or set a specific one from your video by clicking on this color picker tool. You also have controls for vertical text, bold text, and italic text. If you have longer text, such as a paragraph, you can click on these buttons to align the text to the left and right hand side, or align as justified. Next, we have presets of different text styles, as well as a word art library, to choose more advanced text styles. In more text options, you can input values of letter spacing and line height, along with the alignment controller. In the Transform section, you have the options for rotating, scaling, and positioning of the text, as well as the ability to add keyframes to animate these properties. In the Compositing section, we have 18 different blend models and the Opacity slider with the option of creating keyframes as well. By clicking on the Advanced button, you can access the Advanced Text Editing panel. On the left-hand side, we have a preview window with the text editing tools on top, and the text timeline below it. On the right-hand side, we have the text input box with the alignment controller and some text styling tools. For example, you can fill a custom color into your text, or select Gradient Fill from the Type drop-down to fill multiple colors using the color slider, and an Image Fill option to select a custom image of your choice to be displayed in the text. Then we have an Effect Panel to choose a preset for the text style. You can control the intensity by using the opacity slider, as well as introduce some blur to reduce the sharp edges. You can also activate the outline toggle and select a color of your choice and control its opacity, blur, and thickness. You can also add multiple outlines to your text by clicking on this plus icon. And lastly, you can activate the shadow toggle and choose a custom color for the text shadow. Select the direction of the shadow from the Type drop-down. You can also customize the text shadow by adjusting the opacity and blur sliders, as well as change the distance of the shadow. You can also add different shapes in your text from the top toolbar, and can also import custom images into the text timeline. Clicking on the trash icon will delete the layer which is currently selected in the text timeline. You can also easily bring forward and send backward any object by clicking this icon at the right side of the toolbar. Once you're happy with the changes, click the Apply button to save them. You can also add 3D text to your videos in Filmora 12. To do that, click on this Quick Text tool and select Quick 3D Text. This will create a new layer on the timeline. By clicking on it, you can access the text editing panel. Here we have the text box the font changing drop-down, and the font size drop-down. Then we have vertical text option, as well as changing the text to italic. From the drop-down, you can select the 3D material presets or the favorites if you've saved any. To add a preset to your favorites, simply click on this star icon on the preset that you want to add. By hovering the mouse cursor on these presets, you can preview them. Double-clicking on any preset will apply it to your text layer in the project timeline. You can also scroll down to Transform section to increase or decrease the scale of your text, as well as change its position. By switching over to the 3D Animation tab, we have some more presets for the text in and out positions. These animation presets replace the default animation of the 3D text presets. If you want to increase or decrease the animation duration, you can do so from here as well. So this is how you can create and use titles and text in your videos, as well as make your text even better by using the advanced text options such as 3D text in Wondershare Filmora 12. If this video was helpful, 
Give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new to the channel to keep getting awesome Filmora tutorials. Hope to see you in our next video. Till then, bye!